see how it pulls for the next week. Oh, I'm excited. You better be. I mean, it's been canceled so many times. Sadly. Look at how long this August is on. And did you say we have to they have to remake it or something? Remake it? Yeah. Not remake it. Just make Rethink it. Rethink it? Yeah. Oh, oh hey. How's but, it going? Didn't even know we were recording. But uh, anyhow, we got a box from uh Professor Josh to open up, a mystery box, and we got a box from Chrono Toys, keeping our fingers crossed. So let's do it. Alright, so we're back, and like I said, we have a box from Chrono Toys, and we have six boxes from uh, Professor Josh. If you don't know Professor Josh, he started off on Instagram selling his boxes, and now he does have a YouTube channel. I will link his information below, so please go and visit his channel and uh, support him. Um, these were hit or miss boxes from Professor Josh this time. Um, they were $20 a box. Uh, buy five, get the six free. So um, I bought the five. I uh, got the six free for $100 shipped. Um, the bad thing about hit or miss boxes is there's no guarantee. So this bo this pop in here could be a big hit or it could be a $5 pop. It's just That's just the way they go, hit or miss boxes. So um, I opened these yesterday. I know what's in these boxes. I just couldn't wait because I have an illness. But uh, couldn't wait. So me and the wife actually looked at these yesterday. Um, but McKenna here hasn't seen any of them, so she's going to open them and show you show, them, show you what we got. Um, so, yeah, go ahead. All right. Start so, the first, one. the first one, inside of this, maybe, box is um, King Bradley. And I don't know where it's from, but there's that. Yeah, it's Full Metal Alchemist is what it is. And I think, I could be wrong. I think that's a game, but... Or it's a pop animation, so it's a, a show, I guess. I don't know. I've never seen this show. Don't know what this is worth. I'll have it, uh, the price or the PPG above us. Um, but it's Hot Topic exclusive, King Bradley. So that's the first one. All right, I started opening it right now, I guess. Because mm -hmm. I didn't want to... All right, this one is Baseball Fury Green. Um, it's in a soft protector. There's uh, that one. Oh, tilt it. You got a lot of glare on it. There you go. Right there. Baseball Fury, we all know these. These have been around um, many boxes. Um, I don't collect these. I actually sold the ones I had. Um, that's one good thing about these. Uh, they are There is a following for these, and they do sell pretty quick. But uh, this was the Funko Limited Edition. Baseball Fury, the green, the green one. I think these came in red and blue as well. I know blue for sure, but I think there's a third one as well. So, all right, that's two. Let's go for the right. third one. Um, this one is a little gruesome from the Wacky Race Races. Mm -hmm. There's that. One. I don't know if I got it. In the and that one, we were, we were. Um, collecting this line and we decided to not because we just had to make some cuts we were just collecting everything under the sun so we do have a little gruesome already which is on sale so this guy will be going up for sale as well that's a little gruesome all right box number three this one's go through the next one i'll open this one opened. Oh, this is the thing. And there is a piece of paper. And it is heavy. Um, a Barnes & Noble exclusive. So there's that. Maybe. Yeah. You guys can see that. And this one, uh, like I said, don't know the prices on these yet, but this will definitely be 
one of our ones we keep out of this group um, just because we collect Marvel. Uh, we already have a 10 inch out of the thing and we have uh, a thing without the trench coat hat on. So this would be a good in our collection. Yes, it's I think one. it's very cool. Mm -hmm. Wait, that one? Yeah, sure. This one, All number right. five. All right. Oh, this is a uh, Count Chocula soda can. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, this this box included, this uh, set of mystery boxes included cans also, so. Do you want me to open it? Cans are a big part of our collection. Uh, off to the right here, uh, we have this lot of the can they made. And this one just happened to be a common. But there's the common Count Chocula. Couch 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 For those of you that don't, uh, haven't collected cans, they are, these little figures are pretty heavy, uh, but I do, we do like the way they look and feel, but those are good ones. They do come in uh, Bray or Commons, and then they have a chase of each one. Yep. This is the common, so. And here's the pog that comes inside. There's a pog in each can that tells you how many were made and, and if it's a common or a chase. So, all right. And now the fifth box, or sixth, sixth box, box, sorry. Sixth and final one of Professor Josh's, uh... Becca? Am I pronouncing that right? Uh, I believe so. I don't know who this one is. Becca from Pitch Perfect, which I believe is a pop movie, so it's a movie. Alright, there's that. Again, they're in Soft Protector. And there is Becca. And a Soft Protector. Um, people... Pops, I don't collect a whole lot of, unless, I mean, there's instances I do, I guess, but for the most part, I don't. And, um, definitely not Becca from Pitch Perfect, but, uh, that's that one. Here's the Pops from that. So here's the Pops we got from this six boxes. Um, PPG value will be up above. Hopefully we hit our $100 mark and broke even. We didn't hit the Grail this time. I mean, those of you who seen the video, I'll link the video up here. Um... Check that video out. We, we uh, did did get one of the top hits out of uh, one of the last rounds of um, Professor Josh's mystery boxes. So can't get them all the time. But like I said, we added a couple to our collection probably, and um, your seller trade the rest. Anybody see anything they like? Please comment below, and we can work something out. So yes, that's that. Thank you, Professor Josh. Thank you. We will definitely be buying more of your stuff in the future. And like I said, his stuff is below, so please go to that uh, link and support him. Now on to the Chrono Toys box. This was their Damage Box Clearance Bundle, which has six pops in it. It's supposedly Grails, Exclusives, Chases, and some Commons, which hopefully some is some. few, not all of them. But uh, these are supposed to be damaged. Now I haven't gotten damaged boxes from Chrono. I usually get my damaged boxes from Toy USA. And those usually don't have any damage to them. Very minimal. So I don't know what to expect on opening this box. Um, this box was like $40 for six pops. So I don't know what to expect. Um, the big hits in this box were the 9-inch blue Mickey Mouse from uh, San Diego Comic-Con. The 9-inch Buzz Lightyear. and 9-inch Maleficent. Maleficent. There you go. And a 9-inch Batman Chase. So we'll see what we got in here. Um, and this is all sorter, so we'll pull the sorters out. Or no, it's just another box. Double box. Like that? Yep. Now we'll open it from the bottom. In hopes that they're upside down and I don't see what they are. And then I... Yeah, this is... I guess this tells me right away that I didn't get the top hits because this is probably six four inch pops. This box <laughs> it doesn't look like there's a nine inch pop in this box, so hopefully I get some uh, exclusives or, or some chases out of it. But I don't think I got the nine inch. Okay, and right away I see two of them that I do not like. I seen one of the tops. I saw two of the tops, and I think it's cling and clang, which I had plenty of from H uh, and R Puff and stuff. I actually do have that set, and then I have a couple more that are for sale, so. But for 40 bucks, I guess I took the chance with Chrono Toys. 
let's just hope we get something that uh, we can keep. All right, there's the other side where I don't see what it is, but I know these two center ones are 20 and 20, so I'll pull those out first. Here it is Kling. For everybody who has not seen Kling, which is probably nobody, you've seen this guy already plenty of times. That's Kling. And this is Kling from. This is a Toy Tokyo New York 2020 limited edition. Yeah, so they all are. Oh, and yes, it is damaged a lot. Yeah. So let's do this one here. I've already gotten from them. It's the Blue Baseball Fury, which this box is obviously one of their dumps. This one here I got from them, which is the Miro Tagata from My Hero Academia. Um, Miro Tagata, yes, he's up there. So I got him already. This one here is One Punch Man. It's an anime, but I've not seen this guy before, so. Let's hope this is the last time we see that guy. <laughs> Let's hope. We can only hope. We can only wish together. Yes. Oh yes, here's uh, this guy, which is not in my realm anime. At all. And last but not least, we got one that I may keep. Prison Mike from The Office. That's a good one. I've got uh, Mike is uh, Santa. It's classy Santa. And now this is Prison Mike. So may keep this guy. Um, I'm sure just by looking at it, I mean, my value is more than $40, but, uh, unfortunately it's going to have to be stuff I sell, um, because I either have it already or don't collect it, but this one's good. So that's that another lackluster performance by Chrono Toys. But, uh, other than that, Professor Josh, thanks for your box. That was the bright spot of the video. Um, for sure. Um, and that's it. So please subscribe to us. If you've not subscribed, like the video if you liked it and ring the notifications bell so that you are aware every time we drop a video. Yes. Other than that, uh, we'll see you soon. We got some more boxes to open, uh, and edit and do all that good stuff for you. So you'll be seeing that soon coming out. Um, other than that, have a good evening, and we'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.